Rox gets up, I wanted to tell you a little bit about the white coat. Uh, the white coat ceremony at, at Wayne State has become the signature event for initiating students into the pharmacy profession. With receipt of the white coat, you will then become no longer a student, you'll be a student pharmacist, moving your uh, career forward to hopefully becoming a pharmacist at the end of four years. Uh, it is common among medical schools, PA schools, our PA program, for example, uses the white coat as its signature event at graduation, as opposed to at the entry point of the PA degree. So it is quite an honor to receive the white coat. We have worked hard at trying to use this ceremony to instill professionalism and to make connections between students and alumni and faculty. In each white coat, you'll have a note from your advisor that's handwritten, uh, and there'll be notes of encouragement, welcoming. Uh, there will also be a note from an alumni mentor that will be a word of wisdom or a wow note. And you will get uh, personalized business cards. Each code is also monogrammed uh, with your name on it. The business cards are provided by Carol Stepford. Carol? Where is Carol? Each student will receive 250 business cards. Make sure you give Carol a big thanks uh, at the end of the ceremony. Uh, we'll have a little bit more uh, about that from Rox PF. Uh, Rox is the uh, president of your alumni association. He's going to give some welcoming words from the alumni association and talk a little bit more about the wild card. Well, good afternoon, and let me also be among the first to welcome you to the profession of pharmacy. You're probably going to hear this many times today. This afternoon will certainly be one of the most notable moments in your lives, and you will remember this throughout your career. I was sitting in your seats about 12 years ago. Being accepted into pharmacy school is a great accomplishment, and each of you should be especially proud that you have been, that you have been accepted by one of the very best pharmacy programs in this country. This ceremony, as Dean Slaughter has said, is an important first step in becoming a true professional that is admired and respected by many. Although you may not realize it now, this is really the start of a long road that will lead to endless opportunities and personal growth. So, I not only want to welcome you to the profession, but I wanted to introduce you to the Pharmacy Alumni Association. Perhaps to some of you, an alumni association is a venue to meet old friends and recall old memories. While these things are certainly important, I must tell you that the Pharmacy Alumni Association is so much more. While we do promote fellowship among fellow alumni, what you may not realize is that a very big interest is in you as the pharmacy student and we continuously seek opportunities to engage you with us. For example, we will have, we have a student representative from each respective year that sits on our board. So your class will have one representative that is selected to be on our board. And they will, all, they will be sharing any issues or concerns with your class as well as any events that we could help you with, whether it's fundraising, whether it's a, a, a different class a social event, or if it's a convention, or a health fair. We also host several appreciation and networking events, and each of you are personally invited to come and attend these. There are quarterly social happy hours, as well as we have a speed networking event held at the college that connects, uh, that connects pharmacists from multiple paths with the students. We also award the Pharmacy Alumni Association Endowed Scholarship to a first year professional pharmacy student that demonstrates scholastic achievement, leadership, and promotion of community health. So you see, it's more than just a fellowship of a bunch of old friends coming together. What I, what I would just like to ask that starting right now and throughout the next four years, you become actively engaged with our, with our pharmacy alumni. Being involved with your alumni is something you do after you graduate. You have to start this right now. Okay? 
Uh, with this in mind, the Pharmacy Alumni Association, by the gracious generosity of Carol Sturrud, which is an esteemed alum and beloved colleague of all of ours, as Dean Slaughter has said, um, each of you will be receiving a business card holder in, in, uh, in your white coat, as well as your first set of professional business cards. But most importantly with this, you'll be receiving a personalized note that was written and submitted by one of the hundreds of the alumni that are still involved with our college and that want to be connected to you and serve as a mentor to you throughout your program. So please take the time to reach out to these alumni just as they have taken the time to reach out to you and congratulate you on this next new chapter in your life. Finally, my last remarks, I'll, I just want to remind you that as these next four years go by, and they will go by rather quickly, that you always remember and appreciate the superior education you are about to receive from this college and the esteemed faculty here, as well as be involved in as many professional organizations as possible, and most notably the alumni. Because when you graduate, you will automatically be a member, of, a lifetime member of this college. There really is no better way to demonstrate your appreciation for the fine education you're about to receive. So on behalf of the Wayne State University Pharmacy alumni, and we're quite numerous, I want to extend a very warm and sincere welcome to each of you to the profession. Good luck and <coughs>